Okay, I'm going to show how I'm going to transplant some uh, patio uh, tomatoes. So this is patio container tomatoes. And uh, this particular one says that it should be in full sun, uh, six hours a day. I don't get that much sun on this side of the house, but I'm going to plant it here because uh, if not, uh, birds and deer will eat it. So I need to have it in the uh, screamed patio. Just want to show you this. I got uh, this bucket here for um, a dollar at the dollar store. It's pretty good. Um, I think it's about two or two and a half gallon size. And um, I drilled half inch holes all the way around so that um, when I put it down into this uh, black tray, I can fill the water up down here and the water will seep into the holes um, and water the plant from the bottom up. I like that method of watering the plants. What I'm going to do is I'm also going to put some newspaper. Um, actually don't use the type of paper that has uh, kind of this shiny um, film to it because it then uh, won't absorb as well. But this is going to help prevent, I'm going to put this at the bottom of the bucket so that it prevents the dirt from coming out. I'm just going to put it like that. Eventually this paper will break down, but it will also act as a wick to absorb the water on the bottom here. I'm putting that in. And I'm going to fill up my potting mixture. I mixed up uh, some of the rabbit uh, fertilizer and some worm compost and some organic uh, potting soil. I probably need a little bit more. And actually that pretty looks pretty good. I'll probably put a little bit more. I'm going to make it a little dent and then I'll put that in. Dirt doesn't need to be all the way to the top because it is a patio tomato plant. It's the first time I've, um, I'm growing this particular variety, but uh, tomato plants usually take up a lot of space. So I already pre-cut this plastic part. And you could put the whole thing in, but I'm going to take uh, part of this off so that the plant can have more space to grow. You can see the um, roots here. And then I'm going to break this up a little bit and make my hole and put it in. You could put some water in there if you wanted to first. Uh, soil's kind of wet. And my tomato plant soil is wet. So, pushing that down in there, and I'm, you can break off the little leaf on the bottom of this part right here. So when you plant your tomato plants, they should be all the way up to the bottom of your last leaf, and um, a lot of instruction um, instructions on how to transplant your tomato plants, they'll tell you to uh, break off the bottom small leaves. As you can see, this one's already got flowers that are coming up. Uh, so we'll be getting some tomatoes real soon. And I've got, um, because these containers were only a buck, I bought a, about six of them. And I bought two of these plants. So I'm going to see how these plants grow. I'm going to make more holes. As you can see on the bottom, my dirt didn't come out. Um, there it is. It's now transplanted uh, in organic soil with some natural fertilizers and uh, I'll water it make sure it stays watered until uh, it catches on pretty well. Um, every day I'll water it from the bottom up.